Hello everybody, welcome back to the Ohio Cannabis Institute's Small Business Report. I'm your host, Fred Hanover, and hi, good to see you again. What a great day, what a great day. I, I am excited to share with you the results of years of research. Years of, of looking at this medical cannabis industry uh, by myself and by my colleagues and I want to give you a little idea of what we believe the landscape to be. We have looked at it from pretty much every angle, speaking with folks who want to invest anywhere from $10,000, that's really hard to do, not too much available for them, if any, at this point, uh, to folks who have literally wanted to invest $250 million in this industry. And many, many in between. We've looked at over 300 business plans. People who want to get in the cannabis and medical cannabis industry just in Ohio alone. That's a lot of interest. And in that process, we've been able to educate them about some of the things that they needed to look for and some of the things they needed to look out for. And we tried to help the best we could. And quite frankly, came away wondering how small business people in Ohio can participate in this industry. It really does seem to be geared towards those who can afford large businesses or larger businesses or have the ability to put together investor pools or whatever the case may be. So what does that leave the rest of us? Well, you know, it's an industry that I think needs to be looked at carefully because there's so much healing that goes on in it, through it, from it, in many ways, actually, but physically for sure. And this is an industry that needs uh, the right people to be part of it, the people that care about people, right? That's what we really want to do is help people with this medicine. And we've been looking for those people for years. They're out there. They're out there, and 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 some have chosen to participate. Um, and you know, others have chosen to participate. It's an interesting landscape right now. One that, if you're not business savvy, really business savvy, you may want to think twice about entering, because just like the gold rush. It is the wild, wild west in the medical cannabis industry in Ohio today. So, what I've learned is that it's important to be with people who know more than I know and who have experienced more than I've experienced. And that's what I've done. I've associated with people who know far more than I and who uh, have far much more experience. And so what it's taught me is caution. Caution. Absolute caution. And I'm really, really excited because I've recently come across an opportunity in this industry that is cautious, very cautious, that is uh, something that is affordable. And uh, I'm just excited. So I know it's something that will help lives, save lives, heal, heal, it will heal. I've seen it heal. It's so cool to watch, really, to experience that. And, and I, I, uh, <laughs> I don't know. It's cool. So anyways, you should want to share that with you guys. What a great day. There, there, there is a way. And, and really, in our research, we've determined that there are over 30,000 small business people in Ohio that want to participate in this gold green rush, if you will, uh, that haven't had a way. So if you guys want more information about what we've discovered, uh, get a hold of us at the Ohio Cannabis Institute. You can go to our, our website, ohiocannabisinstitute.com, and send in your information. Just say you want some information, and we'll, we'll get back to you on that. Anyways, I wish you a very, very happy holiday weekend. God bless you all. See you next time on Small Business Report. Yep.